Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel, See Me Travel with CJ at, on YouTube. Um, I have some little concerns today. Um, I was going to make a topic today about um, traveling, which was going to be my priority uh, subject today, was about being safe no matter where you go in the world and respecting other countries wherever you go. And um, I woke up with a soft heart this morning and... Um, my main topic today was really about talking about Thailand and how to be safe in Thailand and respecting the Buddha, the culture, and the people. And um, I'm going to come back to that. But today I wanted to talk to you guys about things that are going on in the U.S. Um, it's really saddening that we've had two, two killings within the last two weeks. Um, one was in a mall. Uh, I believe 10 people were killed due to a gunman, a young gunman um, who had shot, went into the mall, and he had a camera strapped to his chest to live stream the shooting that took vent in the mall. Um, you know, I don't know what to say. Um, I grew up in a different time and era. Um, kids normally played outside. They, they, they had they had uh after school programs uh softball football uh ping pong things like that after school programs um i played up i played pop warner football at a younger age um i never played high school football i enjoyed playing pop warner football but back to the subject of what i was saying things for our children in this world today we need help our government needs to come and step down and do something about this just a couple days ago we had another shooting in Dallas, Texas, um, 19 people were killed. 19 people were killed by another gunman. Um, it's just, it's really heartbreaking to wake up and have to deal with these kind of things that are going on um, in the U.S. I'm from the U.S. I, I grew up in California, um, to make a long story short, and um, I have kids and I worry about my kids every day. And then on top of it is what I'm trying to get to the point is we need to wake up as parents. Um, we need when we leave for work every morning and um, our intentions are, are, are well as far as uh, us waking up every morning, sending our kids off to school, not knowing that we may not even see them again. Not knowing that even they may not even see us again that morning once we send them off to school or whatnot. And we're on our daily journeys as far as parents taking care of our kids and trying to go to work and be a provider for them. We need to set goals and boundaries. Um, I, I'm, you know, I'm heartbroken this morning. I, I I'm really am heartbroken because our society and our government and... You know, we, we got a war going on in Ukraine. Um, things are just happening terribly all over the world, man. And it's just really sad and heartbreaking, you know, to wake up and find out that a 16 year old or a 17 year old or an 18 year old or a 19 year old went into a mall and shot 10 people, killed them. And, you know, he live streamed it with a camera uh, mounted onto his chest like it was some kind of video game. I'm really saddened and heartbroken this morning. I, I you know, it, it just, it's, it, it's really sad. It, it really is sad what's going on in our society today where our young children, as parents and, and adults, and, um, you know, I, I'm thankful that I'm able to even talk to people today about this matter, about this situation, even on YouTube, while I'm sitting in my back, I'm sitting somewhere trying to relax trying to put not only my life together, but also my children's life together and also try to understand somebody, children or child that didn't come home last night. You know, and it's really saddening because we as parents, we have to do something. We have to find a way to keep our children's focus and they have to appreciate what they have because tomorrow is not guaranteed our lives and your children's life should be important to your family shouldn't be important your children should be important the government should step in and do something you know i'm i'm all about gun rights and 
all this to protecting yourself. And but then when you also have a child that goes into the parents room and and I'm not speaking, I don't know what happened. I don't know how they got the arms, how they got the weapons, how they got the ARs. But if you got weapons in your house and your children are allowed to go into your cabinet or gun safe and just open it up and pull the weapons out and load them up and go to the school or a mall and shoot someone, there's something wrong. There is something seriously wrong with that. Thank you for watching my YouTube channel today. I hope everybody has a blessed day. And it's really heartbreaking for me today because I have four children. I have five children, actually. And um, it's just really heartbreaking to wake up every morning and try to put, you know, try to, you know, try to figure things out. Why? How come? The reason behind it. And, you know, every day we wake up and, you know, tomorrow's not promised for one. And so protect your children, protect your loved ones and lock up your arms, lock up your arms. You know, if you think your children is having some kind of mental breakdown, get them some help. And even if you're not sure, talk to your children. Thank you. Once again, see me travel with CJ on YouTube. Thank you. And God bless everyone. Thank you.